some new tensions to tell you about this morning between the U.S. and Pakistan after the arrest of five Pakistanis who apparently gave information to the CIA right before that raid that killed Osama bin Laden. CBS's Dana Lewis is in London now with more. Good morning. Good morning, Erica. Pakistan today vehemently denying that it arrested a Pakistani army major as it probes the U.S. raid which killed Osama bin Laden last month. For weeks leading up to the raid on bin Laden's compound, a handful of Pakistanis apparently fed the CIA information, including the license numbers of cars which came and went from bin Laden's hideaway. The New York Times reporting five of those informants were arrested by the ISI, Pakistan's intelligence agency, and that at least one of them was an army major. The sensitive information surfaced last week when at a closed meeting to the Senate Intelligence Committee, CIA Deputy Director Michael Morell rated three out of ten Pakistan's cooperation with America on counterterrorism. And in the weeks that have passed, the Pakistanis have tried to restrict American drone flights over Pakistani tribal areas, to the point drones have had to be moved from Pakistan to bases in Afghanistan. The Pakistani army, in fact, now says it has arrested 30 to 40 people. Some have been released, but it says no army major or any army personnel were among the arrests. One of those arrested was the man who rented a safe house to the CIA to observe bin Laden's compound before the raid, and a Western diplomatic source telling CBS News today there is a strong feeling in the ISI that they have been, quote, stabbed in the back by the CIA which didn't trust them enough to tell them of the raid on bin Laden ahead of time. Erica? Dana Lewis in London this morning. Dana, thanks.